Boxes. Is this it? Is this all I needed to do? Is there anything over there I need? Ah, oh, crap. It's bag, isn't it? Isn't it? Alright, you know what? Let's go. Ow! What happened? Why did that hurt me? I fell? I don't think I fell that far. Ah, oh, crud. Oh, not good. Alright. Jump here. Maybe there's not a water monster, but, uh,. Don't trust this game. Alright. Ah, I missed it again. Curses. Alright. There we go. There we go. Yeah! Sounds like someone's taking a bath. They're singing. Alright. What is over y'all? Oh crap, it is back. Curses. Oh, hello. 8th August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying. But Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Okay. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, because you haven't had a bad feeling up until now? Seriously, if you've gone this long without getting a bad feeling, there is something wrong with you. Then again, it's nothing I didn't know before. Okay, now what? Jump! And hop! Like a bunny. Like Bugsy. Alright, now we're to. Is there anywhere else I need to go? Jump! You can't get me, you crazy water monster thingy. I can't get up there. Crap! Run! Run! Hey, I got up here a second ago. Ah! Choices. Alright, maybe I go over there. Oh! Maybe I go over there. Those are new. Ah, let's try it! Run! 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 Is this thing not here? No, I saw it. Oh well, I'm just too fast for it. That's what it is. Okay, so this is new. Ow, 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 ow. I thought that would happen. What's my health like? Wounds bleeding quite badly. Well, let's not use something unless we have to. Alright. What's this? What 
What did that do? Oh, it turns it off. Okay then. Good. I heard you. Creepy thing. Oh, hello. 9th of August, 1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. Uh-huh. Or it might also kill you. Didn't consider that possibility, did you? Redirect sewer water. How many times do I gotta do this? Okay, I think that might have done it. Did I get the blue flashing light before? I don't think I did. So... I think that's everywhere. Right? Crap. Run for it! Ah! I heard him! Run! <laughs> Run! Okay. Oh, I'm too fast for you, invisible water splasher. That's what I call him. He's the water splasher. Wait, no, not this way. No, 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 no. I need to go this way. Right? I am remembering correctly. This is where the exit is? Yes! Good. So that lowered the, uh, no, that just redirected the sewer water. So, Alexander knew that there must be a way to finish the ritual before it was too late. He had to teach his friend something. Right, I still gotta get this down. Um, I gotta hit it with something, I guess? Is there a rock? Oh yeah, there's plenty of them. Can I throw it high enough? To get it up there? Oh, wow! What do you know? Got quite the arm on me. Perhaps I should be a pitcher. Alright. Well, that didn't work. I guess I gotta hit the chain. Darn it! <laughs> uh. Alright. Throw you back up there. You know, let's throw a couple rocks up there just in case I, uh, I miss. I don't want to have to keep coming back down. You know, I have not run into a single monster in this room. Or, you know, ever since I got out of the, the kitchens. Alright. Now, let's aim for the chain. There we go. Oh. Didn't need the rest of those. Alright, what do we got? The morgue? I don't want to go in the morgue. Okay, fine. We'll go in the morgue. A beautiful wild orchid seemed a testament to nature's strength being able to grow inside Brindenburg. Alas, it was Alexander's studies and care which enabled the flower to blossom. Good for him. I'm sure that makes him a wonderful person. Uh... 
Ja. Do you see, Daniel? It has yielded. What? The shadow. It has? For now. Come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. Well, it is a morgue, Daniel. I'm pretty sure there's not a hot dog stand. Because they wouldn't get a lot of business in a morgue. Alright. What do we got here? Are there monsters? Because I haven't seen any monsters. Oh, look! Dead people. In a morgue. How about that? here. Picked up copper tube. And this does what? Find copper tube found in the morgue. Looks like part of a surgical tool. Okay. Take you shopping? Like Christmas shopping? Quick! Go to the light! The light! Okay, or not. Just trying to help them move on, you know? Oh, they're clawing at the wall. Alright, uh... Is there anything useful in here? The saw? No. Okay, then. Where else can we go? No, don't kill her! Yeah, don't, don't kill her. What he said. Whoever that was. Yay, more dead bodies. What's all this stuff? Okay. Um, oh, hello. Plague outbreak. The strange deaths among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewer, which has recently recently been opened up for use as a means to transport, plague is plagued by particular poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity, but it is clear that this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly, and their contaminated vitae lacks the energy I seek. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. Okay. Well, good for you. So, what's the vaccine? Something tells me I shall need it. Ah, is this it? Vaccine trials! The vaccine enabling my men to work in the fungi-ridden sewer is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been re remedied as the procedure provided uh, proved difficult. The others will perish and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood 
will work as a shield long enough to pass the sewers without any risk of infection. It will do fine for prisoner transport. Oh, so I just need to find vaccinated blood. Alright then. So I don't actually have to make a vaccine, just find someone that had vaccinated blood. <laughs> 